Here comes Sasha. Byron, it's always a treat to see Sasha Banks. Sasha Banks has her own swag. She's got her own confidence, and she knows how to back it up. If there's a camera around, Sasha wants to be in front of it. If there's a spotlight out, she wants to be in the middle of it. Sasha Banks once stood in line for the opening of a refrigerator. You should get one of those uh, rings that say graves on it like Sasha has. I'll pass. Plenty of star power in this tag team match, guys, wouldn't you say? Absolutely, Michael. In fact, if you ask me, all four of these competitors have what it takes to be top single stars here in the WWE. WWE Universe, you are looking at a superstar who is simply blessed to be the best. Just naturally better than everybody else, even when only doing the bare minimum. Well, you talk about some of that natural athletic talent, Corey. Bianca's been exceptional her entire life. She earned all SEC and All-American honors in track and field at the University of Tennessee. And if you just ask her, she'll tell you why she's better than everybody else. You got eyes, Byron, you understand. A freak in the weight room, a beast in the ring. Bianca Belair could do it all. And she's got a lethal hair whip. The Yes Movement is in full effect as Daniel Bryan makes his way to the ring. Man, I never get tired of seeing the WWE Universe react to Daniel Bryan. Everyone's ready, and just oh, like man. that, this tag team match is underway. Guys, there's nothing like a good old-fashioned tag team match. You know what I like about her? She's approaching this match the same as she would if the title was on the line. German suplex! Oh, from behind, Frankensteiner! Nicely done! Oh, elbow to the face. Tackle. Nailed it. Yeah. 
And Sasha Banks just not looking good here. Her and her partner aren't going to let this derail them, though. The good news is that if it gets too out of control, she has her partner she can tag in while she catches her breath in the corner. What a hurricane! That's what you call a bad landing. Beginning to look bad for her here. Her and her partner make it a great tag team. We'll see what they're made of here. She's putting up quite a fight here, Cole, but despite that, now is probably a good time to look for the tag. At this point, I think it's fair to call into question her preparation for this match. She's clearly being outclassed right now. Get in there, ref. Irish whip. I've seen some unique offenses over the years, Byron, but perhaps the most unique thing I've ever seen is when Bianca whips her opponents with her own hair. I have never seen anything like it, Michael. But I'll tell you what, if I was to give advice to anyone facing Bianca, it would be to turn the tables against her. Go ahead and whip her with her own hair. Boom! <laughs> To your point about Bianca's hair, Byron, I do think it's long enough that an opponent could likely use it as a weapon as well. Nope, that won't work. Grabbing an opponent's hair can lead to a disqualification. Besides, everybody knows the best way to prevent Bianca from using her hair is to cut it off, a la Brutus the Barber Beefcake. Bang! Splash! Massive! Oh, clothesline! What a stop! Impact, hip attack, so sudden. When a superstar is in a tag team match and has endured heavy amounts of punishment, they must find a way back to their corner to tag their partner. Something that they have to try is doing create separation between them and their opponent. That space gives a superstar submission specialist Daniel Bryan. Look at her go! <laughs> you gotta like her chances now. Do you hear that thud? God. Oh man, she is rolling now. This might be it. Oh my. Corey, you touched on this before. Part of a tag team's ability to be successful is your ability to counters before it's too late. Down with a face buster. Daniel Bryan stalling a bit here. Ugh. Her and her partner aren't going to let this derail them, though. I really like the resolve we've seen from her in this tag team match, guys. Ouch. Though, I wouldn't be against the tag here. You know, just so she can gather herself a bit. Oh, what an enziguri right in the ear. No, breakneck speed. What a hurricane. Daniel Bryan with a slick reversal. In off the tag. Specifically targeting the leg. Running clothesline. She's beginning to take some heat here. We're going to see what she's made of here, guys. I don't know how much longer she can go on absorbing all this punishment. She needs to find a way to make it to her corner and make the tag. Ladies and gentlemen, by now I'm sure you've heard Bianca Belair describe herself as the EST of NXT. Corey, what exactly does that mean? I'll break it down for you, Michael Cole. It simply means that Bianca Belair is the strongest, the fastest, the smartest, and the baddest around. She is on fire. Ooh, beautiful technique. Nailed it. Corey, thank you for breaking down exactly what it means when Bianca Belair says she is the 
ist of NXT. But don't you think Bianca has a bit of an overinflated ego for somebody relatively new to the scene? Absolutely not, Saxton. Just ask top NXT stars like Candice LeRae or Lacey Evans if it was Belair's ego that beat them. Those were cases of Belair proving she truly is the est of NXT. Wow. She's definitely energized, but she better make sure she saves something for later. Boot right in the jaw. Oh, oh man, what a double knee strike. Right to the start. Bankrupt. Game, set, match. Here's the cover. In a tag team contest, a superstar and partner lock up. They win like that. Says a lot about a duo. We got our money's worth for that one. Take a look. Highlight for one superstar, low light for another. Oh, I can't believe this. Man, oh man, look at that. And that's exactly how she wanted to end this thing. That's it for this tag team match. And what a thrilling match it was. These women make an almost unstoppable pairing.